It was a vicious attack. Police say a teenager assaulted two Westchester officers while trying to avoid arrest. Now, one of those officers is out of work indefinitely. Nine on your side's Butler and Warren County reporter Jay Warren live in our northern newsroom with a story you'll see only on Nine. Jay? Well, officers Gary Gabbard and Matthew Tom Bragel were injured, police say, while trying to arrest this teen. It was June the 17th in the Kingsgate neighborhood of Westchester, and Westchester's police chief says that Gary Gabbard has yet to get back on the job. Today in Butler County Juvenile Court, the teen, just weeks away from his 18th birthday, was brought in for preliminary hearing. He is fighting the charges of assault, resisting arrest, and obstructing official business. It was last month when police reports say here at the Kingsgate condos, someone had broken the globes of several of these street lamps. Someone reportedly saw him in the area, and a police investigation led them to these condos on Saxony Drive. Police say the teen interfered in the investigation, became unruly, and when police tried to arrest him, he struck at least one of the officers in the head. Today, the teen's lawyer, Jeremy Evans, asked for photos of the teen taken at the detention center. It's my understanding that at this point in time, the uh, juvenile detention center has uh, in their possession photographs taken of uh, injuries sustained by my client um, would ask the court uh, to direct the uh, detention center to release those photographs uh, to myself uh, and to the state. Today, the judge ordered the teen to continue to be locked up before trial. Teens say he is being unjustly accused and say that evidence is going to be brought forward that will cast doubt on the police version of events. This case is headed for trial in two weeks. Jay Warren, not on your side in the Butler Warren newsroom. All right, Jay, thanks.